A significant Russian attack on Avdivka is not local efforts intended solely to fix Ukrainian forces. The Institute for the Study of War has revised its earlier assessment, adding that the think tank is not ready to state the exact objectives and likely outcome of Russian efforts there. Russian forces likely launched a significant and ongoing offensive effort around Avdiivka in the region of Donetsk since the 10th of October. There it is. The Institute for the Study of War observed them simultaneously attacking northwest, also west and south of Avdivka using armored assault groups, rotary wing aircraft and concentrated artillery. Avdivka city military administration had Vitaly Barabash indicated that Russian forces are carrying out assaults with air support in 10 to 12 directions around the settlement. The Institute for the Study of War states Russian forces have not secured any major breakthroughs near Avdivka as of the 12th of October and are unlikely to immediately cut off Ukrainian forces in the city. Ukrainian military observers framed Russian offensive operations against Avdivka as, quote, major attack and noted that Russian forces used an unusually high number of armored vehicles in combat. Geolocated footage indicates that Russian forces have likely lost at least a battalion tactical group's worth of armored vehicles in offensive operations around Avdivka. Now, the Institute for the Study of War admits that its previous assessment was likely overstated and Russian forces may not be applying the lessons learned from the previous offensive operations near Vuhledar in February 2023 or around Kiev in March 2022 when Ukrainian forces destroyed a disorderly advancing column of Russian armored vehicles.